In problem 24, Armin is trying to decide whether to buy a season pass to his college basketball team's 20 home games this season. The cost of an individual ticket is $14, and the cost of a season pass is $175. The season pass will admit Armin to any home basketball game at no additional cost. What is the minimum number of home basketball games Armin must attend this season in order for the cost of the season pass to be less than the total cost of buying an individual ticket for each game he attends? All right, let's do a guess and check approach. We're going to compare individual tickets versus season pass. Now, the season pass is one number. It's $175. But we're going to try these numbers and see which one is going to give us a lower, is going to give us a higher price for the individual ticket. Because that's what we're asking for. We want to know this is a lot of money. But when is it actually cheaper to pay this than the individual ticket price? So we're going to try and guess this for these answers. So we'll start with H. So let's say he attends 12 games. What's that going to cost if he buys the individual ticket? Well, each ticket is $14 times 12. And so that's $168. So for this, it's actually cheaper for him to buy the individual tickets than to buy the season pass. Now, 175 is going to stay for all five of these answers. Now, if he attends fewer games, then this price is going to be less. And so that means this is still a better deal. We don't want that. We want the season pass to be a better deal. So that means G and that means F are not viable answers. So let's try letter J, 13. Let's say he attends one more game. So 13 games at $14 a piece is 182. So now it's actually cheaper to buy the season pass. So now letter J is what we want because if he attends more games, all 20, that's going to be 280. But what the question asks is what is the minimum number of home games he has to attend in order for this to be more than that? So the answer is letter J. Now an alternative way to answer this is to say, all right, 14 times the number of games equals 175. And so if we take this and divide fo by 14, 175 divided by 14, x equals 12.5. So that means he has to attend 12 and a half games in order for these, the individual ticket and the season pass, to be equal. Now, in order for the season pass to be cheaper, he has to attend more. So that's why the answer is 13 and not 12. If he attends 12 games, the individual ticket price will be cheaper.